little locomotive we're looking at here now, Sal, is uh, number 19. It's a 1915-282 Baldwin oil burner. Uh, at, uh, originally, uh, back in the uh, 20s, this locomotive was used in this valley uh, for the uh, timber industry, and then it had some um, uh, jaunts in some other parts of the country. Uh, then it ended up in uh, southern Oregon, and in this year, uh, early this year, Wairika bought it back as we see it now and restored it. And uh, this uh, was taken, uh, what you're seeing filmed here, was on Saturday, August 12th, 1989. We look inside the cab here now. This is uh, when it's uh, standing by the depot uh, in preparation for the uh, uh, one trip per day that it makes. It makes a three-hour trip uh, each day, Saturday and Sunday, uh, one trip only with about a uh, one-hour layover in Montague for lunch. Um, uh, in a little while here on the uh, trip back from Montague, uh, I had the privilege of having my first uh, cab ride, uh, so we'll see some neat pictures from inside the cab uh, uh, about 15 minutes from now.
couple of shots from inside their little depot here. A uh, couple of pieces of equipment, a water spout from above right there, and in a second, uh, one of their little speeder cars. And uh, then in a minute here, I'll show you uh, a, uh, a couple of minutes here of a large scale model railroad. <laughs> I don't know a lot about model railroads, but this is the largest setup that I'd ever personally seen. Uh, as you can see, uh, quite a multitude of cars, uh, uh, 30 or 40 cars in some instances here. Uh, I'll give you a minute or two here and uh, we'll go uh, on the start of our uh, train trip from Wairika to Montague, California. By the way, this uh, city of Wairika is uh, my hometown. Uh, we're about uh, uh, 30 to 40 miles from the Oregon border in Northern California. <laughs> 